Hello, today I'm reviewing the Twisby Classic. I'll give an introduction, then talk about the pen's performance, and finally discuss its practicality and my overall opinion. Twisby is a company from Taiwan. I happened to live in Taiwan and bought it at a pen store in Taipei for 1,400 NT, which is just under $50 US. Here I have the turquoise color, but it also comes in black, burgundy red, sapphire blue, and white. I'll be using extra fine and medium nibs today, although the full options are extra fine, fine, medium, broad, and a 1.1 millimeter stub. It's a piston filling pen, can be disassembled for maintenance, and comes in a standard clear Twisby box with replacement O-rings, a wrench for disassembly, and silicone grease for the piston. Most of Twisby's pens are clear. Here I have their popular Eco model, and although I love seeing the full ink on display in a demonstrator like this, I really like that Twisby offers the classic. It's slimmer and more professional, and the additional chrome gives it some class. It does have a functional ink window, although it's obviously less easy to discern the ink level than on a full demonstrator. I have no problems with the screw-on cap, not too many rotations, no cross-threading, quick and easy. The O-ring at the base provides a seal while also giving a resistance, so you know it's closed firmly. I like how the facets of the body line up with the cap every time. The finial is one of the high points of this pen, with a clear dome that projects the logo, making it viewable from all angles, almost floating. The fixed clip works fine, not too stiff, but enough to hold securely, although it may have some trouble getting over a really thick jeans pocket, it's, I still got it to fit over mine. The Classic fits well in the hand. It's balanced, and I don't find the step down nor the threads to be an issue. However, this pen doesn't post well, and that's my biggest complaint. Originally, the Classic wasn't meant to post at all, and the cap slid on the back, but it rattled loosely. Other people complained too, so Twisby added these O-rings so the cap would friction fit as it posted. Well, it, it does work, but the fit is too weak, so every time I try to write with it, the cap pops loose after just a line or two. So I simply use it unposted. Perhaps some slightly larger O-rings would fix this problem. The piston filling system is easy to use, and although a small bottle of extra silicone grease is provided, I haven't found a sticking piston to be an issue. I like that Twisby subtly wrote the make and model on the piston turning knob. Here I'm using Pelican Edelstein Aquamarine ink. The writing experience is very good with an extra fine nib. It flows very well, not too wet, not too dry. I really love the line variation you can get from it, and look how the feed keeps up with all of that flexing. That's one of the best things about this pen and really makes it a fine writing instrument. With a medium nib, the Classic becomes a much wetter writer and doesn't seem to be practical for flex anymore. The wider nib and greater ink flow does enhance the smoothness even further, giving it less tooth and more glide. I swapped this nib with one from the Eco model, and that's a great option to have because I really enjoy both of these models, and it's nice to switch around the nibs among them. I'll also note that the nib can be swapped with the Twisby Mini models as well. Reverse writing is possible with both of the nibs. It's a little scratchy, but can be sanded smoother depending on how much you want to risk altering your nib. Overall, I really enjoy the look of the Classic, and I use it often. Mainly, I love the extra fine's consistent flexibility that's hard to find on other steel-nibbed pens, although you do need to press a little hard to get it. And with an extra fine nib during normal writing, it's still smooth, and the ink lasts a very long time between fills. The Eco is about half the price of the Classic, and overall a better value. But to me, this pen looks nicer, it's a pleasure to use, and if I lost it, I'd definitely buy another one. Twisby is known for having great customer service, so that's good to know if anything goes wrong with your pen.
Thank you very much, and I hope this video helps you out. Cheers.